a plexiglass serving tray. And these are the 11 by 14, two sheets of plexiglass that I'll be using. Okay, so I have a, a different set of diamonds that I'm going to be using. That's what you see in these bags. I'm going to kind of mix, mix them up and stuff like that. And then I know these all will be the lids that I use. Okay. This will be the legs, okay guys, that I'll be using with this project. So the first thing we're going to do is peel off the side of the film. We'll do this side first. That way I can begin to do my legs, okay? So we'll move that out of the way, okay? And then we'll wipe it off. Just one second. And that's what I'm getting ready to do now to clean it. Okay. So, just one second. I'm going to clean it. And then we're going to go ahead and add on this side. Okay. I just like to clean it so everything can stick good. Okay. And we're gonna go ahead and apply it some E6000 the leaves. Okay. Alright. And that there. And we'll move this up where you guys can see it. Okay, I'm gonna use the E6000 that I always use and I tell you guys all the time, depending on what you're using it for, I'm using the clear. And this is the clear one, okay? So. Clean the best off these legs. Okay. And we're going to go ahead and put this first leg down. And I use the charter. I may put some glue on it. I got it. So you just take that top and hit it. And then it's open. I don't know if I really want to do this. I think I may just want to apply. Let's see how this is going to work. Hold on. Just one second. Okay, so we got it open now. And let's see. I'm just going to go around the top of it. Because I want it to hold really good when I do this, guys. So that's basically why I want to do it like that. Okay. I'm going to put the top back on because it oozes, it, it kind of oozes out a little bit, so that's why I do that. So let me put, I don't want these two touching because it gets to slipping and sliding when you try to mix the two. Okay, so I'm going to stick this first one on. Okay. Because I want this to be able to stick. Okay, that's one. All right. So now we're gonna do the other. Okay, move that out of the way. I'm gonna do this other leg. So I'm gonna apply all the legs to it, and then I'll be back and show you what it looks like. Okay, guys. Okay, everybody. Now that the legs are added, I'm gonna give it a few minutes to dry. Even now, I did. What I did around the uh, perimeter of the hole that's under the bottom where the screw goes, I left the hole empty and I just took the uh, E6000 and put it around that. So inside that hole, I actually put the uh, glue from the glue stick, from the glue sticks that I used. I put the glue inside of the hole, just enough to fill it up to where when I place it down, it'll stick just to hold a little bit because I didn't want to combine the two together because then this will be slipping and sliding everywhere. So, I'm going to push that to the side, and we're going to let that dry. Okay. Okay, guys, I had to go back and add some uh, legs to the middle because it was sinking in the middle. So, I had to add that to that. So, I'm going to sit some stuff on top of it to let it uh, cure and dry really well. And then we're going to take the film off of this side
And then a lot of it is trial and error, being that I've never done it before. Okay. And then I'm actually putting it to, but I will be putting something here to let this one dry good. Okay, guys, so I'm back, <clears throat> and um, I added, I ad went ahead and added the center pieces that I was telling you about that was missing these legs right here. I added three more in the center, and then I just took these diamonds and set it on top of the tray because I'm about to glue them down. So this will be the next step. So that's the only thing you didn't see on camera, but you already saw the tray prepared. And then all I did is took these legs, like I said, and just added a third row in the middle to give it that support because it was sinking down in the middle. So I knew I had to get more legs. So they finally arrived. So I'm going to finish glue these down and then I'll be back to show you guys what it looks like. Okay, guys. Now I went and added some little diamonds on the inside. I mean, in on top of the tray as well with the bigger diamonds. I added some of those just to fill it in some. Now we have this other sheet of plexiglass that's going to go on the top. I'm going to take the film off of it and I'm going to glue it down and start letting it dry. I'm thinking about putting lights in it and that's what I'm thinking about. I'm not sure yet, but I'll, I'll make a decision shortly if I do that. So let me go ahead and glue this to the top, take the film off, and I'll be back to show you guys the finished look. Okay, guys, now, <clears throat> excuse me, now that we have the tray complete, I took these up, uh, handles and just set them there. They're not glued down yet, but I just wanted you guys to see the finishing uh, look of this uh, tray, and it is gorgeous, y'all. It is gorgeous. God is so awesome. He does it every single time that I pray over it, and he helps me create a masterpiece. I'm going to do another angle for you guys to look at it and see it. Um, see it as it is gorgeous. So I'm excited for you guys on tonight. I'm ready for you guys to win it. Thank God, you know, that, you know, you guys are going to be getting these beautiful gifts and putting them in your homes. If you don't mind showing me pictures of them where you set them up at and things like that. But anyway, um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, put a little video up where you guys can see what it looks like from the top. So now that it's finished, I'm going to go over here and finish this other one over to the side that I have got to put some sides on. And then that'll be everything finished, okay? I love you guys, and I'll talk to you guys later tonight. Mwah.